sculptures. Sculptures. You can almost hear the wheels turning. C'è un uomo, va lui dentro della steva di carico. in a moment. Signore, I know someone is here. Yeah. Mr. Black, I knocked first. Welcome. If you recall, last we met, I said I hoped we'd have an opportunity to chat again. I guess I neglected to mention when. I'm sure had we agreed on midnight, uh, I would have remembered. <laughs> Social gas. <Yeah>. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Hunting? Hunting, yes. Santoro thought he saw a rat, Mr. Black, in the cargo hold. Oh, dear. Little devils do seem to have an affinity for ships, don't they? Ah, but this one was particularly devilish. He escaped from a sealed compartment. Santoro thinks he must have climbed up to the cargo loading hatch and gotten out. What do you think? Whatever Santoro says is fine with me. Then we end the hunt. <laughs> eh, Santoro, do I compare, per favore? Uh, tell me, Mr. Black, what were you looking for? Looking for? Oh, my pardon, please. What are you looking for? My English could be better. <laughs> Funny, I thought you put plenty of English on that. Actually, I just came by to, uh, chat about the shepherds and to question me you think i stole the sculpture <laughs> for what a ransom talk to the international bank mr black ask about my assets my credit rating i have more than enough money i hold this position with my government simply as a patriotic gesture patriotism my brothers and i started life as very poor street children in milano survival then was a crust of bread I'm afraid the price of bread crusts is up, even in Milano. How politely you insinuate, Mr. Black. <laughs> but this is not the moment to discuss one's childhood. Right. Wrong time for reminiscences. Well, perhaps we'll have an opportunity to do this again sometime. 
Hopefully in daylight. Uh, <laughs> ciao. Ciao. Uh, the other one's for you. <laughs> Arrivederci. He knows. How did that man get on the ship? How can this happen? He saw the cargo hold. Uh, but, signore, there was nothing to see. I, I, and he stole my watch. Hey, uh, Pop. Hold on to that. How come a watch? I thought we were after the shipping info on the farm machinery. Are you referring to, uh, to this? <laughs> Pretty good, huh? I found it filed under drawer. You know, this watch looks expensive. Pop, I ask you to hang on to it. Not hock it. Right. I know we'll get it straightened out. The board just panicked, I, I guess. Sure. Look, Ben, what are your plans? Plans, David? Who the hell's gonna hire me now? Mr. Cameron, I think you ought to see this. A marble finger. Nice touch. Is this the real thing? It could be. Sure. It came wrapped in this. Five million dollars for the location of the rest of the shepherds. What the hell kind of a ransom note is this? No instructions for payment, no drop point, no nothing. I've done an old manual typewriter, notice the blurred O. Well, what do you know? I had the same thing shoved under my door this morning, except with this. Hmm. Note the missing finger. And in the true tradition of today's kidnappers, today's newspaper. Proving, I suspect, the freshness of the merchandise. I was wondering how we should tell the TV people about this. What? Maxwell Station gets a really good share, but there's... Whoa, 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 whoa. Look, uh, I'm doing this for Hank, and because it's an interesting case. It's not for airtime or close-ups. But you know their type, Alex. Reporters. They're going to find out anyway. Not for me. Uh-uh, Tuesday. Well, one of your trucks might have picked it up. Farm machinery, mostly. Came off a ship called the Amerigo. You did? He did? Name's Brocco? Lou Brocco. Listen, put him on, buddy. We gotta talk. Bingo, boy. East River Cartage, out of the Bronx. They're putting the driver on. Name's Lou. Beautiful. Offer him a thousand if he'll take us back to where he dropped the stuff off. A thou? Say, how come I don't get to read that Tazi stuff, same as you? It's from Interpol, Pop. For eyes only, I promised Hank. Look, uh, set something up with the driver. I'll be back in about an hour. Pop, please, the feet. Oh, hi, Lou. Listen, I understand you drove a load up around Terrytown, Nyack somewheres. Uh, look, pal. How'd you like to pick up a quick 500 clams? I could come back another time. You got something to say, say it. Mind if I say it on your side of the door? Thank you.